you grew up in the 80s, you had He-Man toys. And if you didn't play with them and left them in the box, you could be rich today. Let's look at 10 of the most expensive He-Man stuff on eBay. Welcome back to the Junk Room, everybody. It's me, the Jumpman, coming back at you with another video. That's right, two videos a day, noon and eight, Monday through Friday. Weekends are random. You never know what you're going to get. This past weekend, we played Nintendo games live. It was a lot of fun. Anyway, we're going to look at He-Man toys. That's right, He-Man toys, ones that currently have sold on eBay for a lot of money. We're going to do the top 10 ones that sold for the most money. Some of these are just regular He-Man. You're going to be like, what? Why is that so much money? But... It was. Just think of it. If you didn't open these toys as a kid, he could be retiring today. But then you would have missed out on the fun playing with He-Man. You would have got to play with Men at Arms, Mini Faces, Skeletor, Beast Man. Or what about Skunko? I call him Skunko. Y'all told me his name was Stinko or something. I don't know. But anyway, let's talk at number 10. As you can see here, it's the original He-Man on his first card. 8-back. As a Star Wars collector, I know 12-back. I didn't know it was 8-back. Only 8 figures seen on the back of this card. And how much does this thing sell for? Oh, my. Remember, this is sold prices. This isn't asking price. This is sold prices. $11,955. I hope they got free shipping on that. Can you believe that? Almost $12,000 for a 1983 He-Man Still on the card. It is a nice looking card and everything. And just seeing this card brings back some memories, man. No toy brings back memories more than He-Man and Star Wars for me. Uh, I only played with He-Man for maybe about a year and a half, but whew, what a year and a half it was. But let's look at something else that's a little cheaper than $12,000. Check this out. Vintage Masters Universe. He-Man Strength Tester. I've never seen this. I guess it was like in the arcade game. You know, you pull, push it and see how hard you can push it and see how strong. I've seen other ones, but I've never seen a He-Man one. This one's pretty cool. And it sold for very close to $8,000. One penny away. You think they could have got one more penny out of the deal. But no, they didn't. This thing's pretty cool. I don't know if it still works. Look, his lights up on the chest. Try to get red to impress the ladies, I guess. I would probably get a three. And he'll say, wipe out. Wimp, wimp, wimp. Or something like that. But it's pretty darn cool. And check out this He-Man right here. Laser Power He-Man. Remember that? I don't. I was out of He-Man by the time Laser Power He-Man came out. It's a big old card right there. I think that might be a foreign card. How much does this sell for? Well, we got a big drop here, but still a lot of money. $2,552 and two cents. What the hell? What? Two cents and a $10 shipping. Come on. If you sell a toy for $2,000, $2,500, give the dude a cut on shipping. Give him free shipping. He deserves that at least. Oh, let's look at another one right here. How about this one? This one here took me a second because it looks just like a regular He-Man. It says Mattel, but it's from India. That's right. Did you know they sold He-Man toys over in India? I didn't know that. Learn something new every day. And here he is, loose, complete. He's got his axe. A lot of us forgot that He-Man came with a battle axe. No, I'm not saying He-Man was married. He came with a wife action figure. It came with an actual axe. And a sword. Of course, two swords. You put them together with He-Man. And a shield. Man, really great stuff. But here it is, the He-Man from India, and it sold for $2,000 even. Zero cents and $11.45 shipping. Come on, dude. Come on, give the guy free shipping. But whew, can you believe it sold for that? And again, we're looking at sold prices, not asking price. Now let's look at He-Man playset. That's right, it turned your playset. Again, I was out of He-Man by the time this came out. I would have loved this thing as a kid if I had it. This thing looks awesome. And to find it in the boxes, I know it goes for a lot in the box, but apparently it goes for a lot out of the box also because this thing sold for $1,900. $1,900 for a playset. <sighs> but it looks pretty darn cool. I'll, I'll, I'll give them that one right there. And what about another playset? This one is still in the box slime pit now i did a video about this how it upset parents and people didn't click a lot of people i talked to didn't click on it. it's like oh i know why it upset people because the slime got in the carpet no no the video wasn't about that the parents were upset for a different reason but you're gonna have to check out that video to find out why but there it is the slime pit how much did it sell for one thousand five hundred ninety nine dollars ninety nine cent Whew. and i've just noticed this a lot of these that sold have the same seller. This guy must be a huge He-Man collector or dealer, I should say. What a lucky guy. They probably come from 
Dallas Toys. Man, these guys over in Dallas, this ain't a plug. They always got a lot of good stuff on eBay and on their website. I know they do. Got a lot of cool vintage stuff over there. Now, before we look at another one, I just want to remind you. Did you know Junkman, me, Junkman, has a second channel? There's two channels. There's Junkman Plus channel. Over there, we put up clips from past shows. We put up clips from live shows. We just throw up something that I don't think fits in the main channel. Throw up a lot of shorts. Have a lot of fun over there. So, in the link in the description, you'll find it. Or just go to YouTube.com slash at that Junkman Plus. That'll take you to the Plus channel. Check it out. Plus, you're going to love it over there. Trust me. It's a little more laid back over there. It's a lot of fun. But let's look at Stinko. Oh, Skunko. Stinkor. So whatever his name is. All I know is he stink. He smelled like the inside of my grandma's purse. Woo! This guy smelled bad. And you could buy him on card, sealed, unpunched for $1,550. I can't believe this this figure went for that much. I mean, well, you know, figure people really fell in love with. I mean, it wasn't like we were talking. We're like we're talking Ram Man, and that's a great figure. Everybody loves Ram Man. Well, what about a figure that's associated with bread? Now, this figure was a mysterious figure for years. Luckily, my friend over at Spectre Creative, he figured out what this figure was and did a whole video with it. So that's why I never did a video on it because I can't say more than he already did. So check out his channel. But this is believed to come with Wonder Bread. And it's just He-Man, painted different. And he's half naked, just got his fuzzy underwear on. And how much is this thing? $1,500. $30 shipping. It's not even in a package or nothing. It's just a loose He-Man figure. You just wrap some bubble wrap in it and throw it in a box. It's not going to break. Guy spent $1,500. You couldn't get him free shipping. $30 shipping. Only one bid. Only one bid. But there it is, Wonder Bread. And I like this one. This is not really more action figure. This is more role play. He Man Sword comes with a sword. It looks like two different. Maybe it's a sleeve to put the sword in and a shield. It doesn't look like He Man for the cartoon shield. That's a bummer right there. But I can't believe this thing sold for so much. It also almost sold for $1,500. $14.99. $0.99. And $29.99 shipping. $29.99 shipping. I bet he was like, well, at least it was under $30 shipping. But come on. Come on. Anybody, if you spend over a thousand, watch out, Junkyard Dog. Sorry about that. Junkyard Dog kind of gets excited when I talk about He-Man toys. He thought I was buying him this. Oh, I'm not the one that bought it. Trust me on that. But here it is. Light up sword and shield. Man, what a lot of money. And let's look at one more. This one's pretty cool. And it's a retail store display. Check this out. It's a weird looking He-Man. I mean... He's got either a Corky haircut or a Pete Rose haircut. I will say what the other haircut they look like, but uh, I'll get demonetized. So I'll just say a Corky haircut or a Pete Rose haircut. About the same thing. You'll know what I'm talking about. But here's a store display. You don't get the ruler with it. You just get the display. The ruler here is just to show you how big and hard it is. But here it is. $1,472. 37 people bid it on this thing. 37 people bid it on this. I don't blame them, but I wouldn't. Oh my God, I just noticed this. $220 shipping? Now I can understand this thing's probably fragile. You don't want it to break with $220 on top of the $1,472? Sorry, sorry. That's just, that's just, that's just, that's just too much for shipping. That's just, that's just, that, unless this, uh, unless this guy lives in South America and he's bringing it to you on a bicycle, this, that's just too much. For $220, $220 for shipping? Man, but he does have 100% positive feedback, so that's very good, very good right there. But, believe it or not, let's a look at 10 expensive things that are currently sold on eBay related to He-Man, Masters of the Universe. Hoo -hoo, now I have the power, and you have the power too because you're watching Junk Man. Well, I want to thank you. We'll be back tomorrow with two videos, and as always, I'm going to my content. Subscribe to the channel. Talk again soon. Hey, jump man channel popping though. Thank you, sir, for that unsolicited testimony.